fucking turning this monkey out! <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I'm your humble narrator, and welcome back to Awesome Knots. Today I will do a victory with Skoldier, the space viking, in the Yogscast costume. Daddy needs a treat! Daddy needs a treat! Give daddy a treat. Come on, honey. Daddy wants a treat. God damn. Hooray, friends! We're all here together again with Big Fatty Fat Skoldier. And we've got Derple on our side, so that's nice. We're not going to be the only tank. And uh, Raylan should be in the back there doing doing what she does best. Uh, shooting people in the face from a distance. So I'm going to just collect some solar, lurk around. Skoldier has... Oh, it's this guy. Oh, it's this guy! In the last game, we lost because he was just turtling insistently sitting behind the turret so I'm predicting that we are going to uh, dominate in this game go ahead shoot me shoot me Rocco shoot me Ugh. yeah yeah <laughs> Skoldier is so awesome with his throw uh, he also has an earthquake that does some DOT I really like to upgrade the range of the earthquake and the DOT damage of the earthquake as well as making it go to the front and the back the throw you can add damage to, you can increase the distance and the stun of it, which is a really good option. And then, uh, there's a lot of other stuff you can do for the throw. I like, uh, increasing my attack speed every time I do a successful throw. And then, when combined with the punch, uh, if you get the Healy punch, then you can start healing yourself on the third hit combo. Then you can get the stun on the punch, and then either range or damage is usually what I go for, depending, uh what I feel I need for team makeup. I think today I will go for, well, it's hard to say yet. Probably gonna be damage though, just because I know Vinny and Yuri are extremely both vulnerable to the stun, so I'm not gonna need the range on them. I can just basically uh, smash them in the face, and I did take that mine on purpose to, uh, to clear for the droids a little bit. Just kinda lurking around. Oh shit, he's gonna get me gonna get me I need to heal yeah I'm really scared of Rocco and his his little arrows oh you want some bro come, come get some huh yeah yeah <laughs> all right I, I can't handle much more of that but I do have enough to go by the uh, heal punch which is usually what I go for before boots or anything else even though scold you're super slow without the boots um, yeah it's important to get the longevity and make sure you're at full health as much as possible because with the heal punch fully upgraded, you can basically uh, take two droids melee pretty easily. And there I just use my throw to uh, to get the droid away from my turret. I know that Rocco's still scared. Yeah, he's scared. For good reason. He's scared. Boosh! Come here, punk! Yeah! <laughs> I love Skoldir. He's just got so much power. That's right. That's right. You run! You run! <laughs> Uh, the best part about Skoldier probably is that you don't really need to aim in order to play him. His attacks are melee, his throw is uh, basically just based on how close you are, as long as you're facing the right direction. And the same with his, uh, his Earthquake, which is really, really cool. It makes him an extremely powerful character. And there again, I just throw the droids away from the turret so they, uh, they don't get any nastiness. You're not allowed to hit this turret. This is my turret. Don't set up there, Raylin. <laughs> Yeah, I would taunt that rail in too. <laughs> that was silly. I'll just sit here. I'll, I'll snipe you good. Gonna need to keep an eye on on that one. But that's all right. I know Derple Derple's doing the thing. Seems pretty self self sufficient. And that time rift did really help me out there. I su I suppose it's gonna be a big help against the Rocco. And I'm scared to jump up. Um. There is a different sound between Yuri's mines and Durple's snares, but I'm not very good at spotting it, so I just play it really, really cautious whenever I hear the beeping. Um, because yeah, you don't you don't want to accidentally jump into a mine. That's just retarded. Yuri is nothing if you, he doesn't have his mines. Hey, buddy. Oh, I was hoping I'd nail him and then throw him, but I'll save it. It's all right. You can get thrown. No. It's not going well. Not going well. Oh shit. <laughs> I guess it went okay. Ah, I did my part there. I lure. Awesome. 
So we are tearing both of their turrets up. About halfway through both of them right now. And uh, there's nobody even trying to defend. They're more concerned about not dying than uh, their turrets not dying. Which is fine. That's not the way I play at all though. And it drives me crazy when my teammates do it. So uh, I'm really glad to hand it to these guys and just beat on the turret while he stands behind it. And kind of show them that uh, that's not the way to do it. <laughs> and there with three heal punches, I heal myself completely back up. And uh, yeah, get these droids out of here. Kind of waiting for some assistance. Oh, there's a fucking Vinny. Boop, I still see you. I'm not blind. <laughs> not completely blind, anyway. And I'll get those uh, solar coins and then health, just in case that Rocco decides to pull his vengeance. Um, Skoldir really does counter the vengeance well, especially with the plus to throw range. You can just kind of uh, put Rocco out of your way rather than trying to get away yourself. <laughs> Which is pretty interesting. Haven't gotten any kills yet, but uh, yeah, just trying to throw that monkey. I guess the beeping is not his uh, his minds, and the monkey has the the gall to taunt. Dude, are you kidding me? <laughs> You're getting owned right now, son. Oh, and that fishy, that fishy. I don't know where he went. There he goes. There he goes. Get him. Get him. No, no. I don't want to get the solar boss. Oh shit, this is a bad place. They did get me! They found their opportunity. So during the respawn period, I did buy some stun punch, and I'm gonna feel, finish up my healing punch. So now I should be able to, to hang just fine with this Yuri, and uh, I plan for it to go not very well for them. Boosh! Aw. Oh. But if I can stun that uh, Vinny enough, he won't be able to fly around me. Let's go, let's go. Durple, 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 Durple do. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there was a mine up there. Shit. Oh, I forgot all about that. All right. I'm so sad that that punch missed, or I would have ran in and grabbed him, but I need to heal up just a little bit more before I try and overextend myself. And that is probably the best part about Skoldir, is just he's always at full health. Even when he's brawling, he's healing himself up, so you need to be able to do some massive burst damage. Get out! Get out! I'm coming for you, Bo! <laughs> yeah, and I let my droids do a little damage on that turret. I would have liked to have done some damage myself and killed the Rocco, but it was not to be. Um, yeah, he's still not really pushing the lane at all. Just wave. Yeah, what? You're, you're at full health and you just sit at the turret, like... This is not the way to win, people. If you're watching this, please don't ever do this. You need to take the middle of the lane if you want to get the solar advantage, if you want to win. And you probably want to win. That's that's why most people play this game. So, uh, yeah, I guess Derpa went home. I'll just grab this. Yeah, full health. Make sure you land that third punch. Keep you from killing another creep. You could save him for your buddies. And he missed me with that arrow, thankfully, but why is he just lurking? <laughs> like. It's really off-putting to me. Oh, uh, fuck. Shouldn't have done that. I will grab him. I'll fucking throw the shit out of him. Mmm. Raylan's not gonna back me up here. Oh, Derpo. You got some balls. Let's go, bro. Mmm. They're at our turret, but just some droids. We seem to have all of their players occupied pretty well. And I just helped that Yuri across the Derpo. That was not a good idea. Oh, uh, we did get the Vinny. I'm still blind. You bastard! Yeah! Get that fucking Rocco. And me and Durple are gonna pull back out. I'm going home with my... Oh, no. I'll just clear this lane. We'll clear this lane up. I mean, they are dead, so... Yeah, that's... They're gonna kill the droids before they even get to the turret. I'm going home. You see me, Raylan? Goodbye! <laughs> uh, yeah, base damage of punch is good, but I need some boots. And then we'll go for, yeah. Of course, base damage. It is the best. It is the best ever. Uh, and you'll see how fast exactly it chews things up. 25% uh, more on a punch that already does such an extreme amount of damage is just insane. I could also throw these droids over my shoulder, but I don't want to go chase them down. Uh, so we'll just do the damage on the turret. And I see Derpo's a little nervous about the Vinny down there. He was pointing with his bullets. <laughs> 
So I go to help him out, and then we'll push back in on the turret. Throw this monkey. Throw this monkey. Oh! Hey, they're alive. Yeah, boy. And there goes the Vinny. I'll body block for the Durple so we can get the fuck out of here. And, uh, yeah, get my heal. Get my heal on! Oops, missed the third punch on that guy. No problem. We're back in on the turret already. Hey, guys, I'm here. Do it, Raylan. Shoot the turret. What's wrong with you? What What was happening in your brain? Jesus Christ. Yeah, all right. Kill the droids. Whatever. <laughs> Where's the Durple? I need the Durple. Get out! Get out! Oh, I'm kind of scared of this Vinny. Yep, 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 yep. Damn. Mine is the path to victory! Maha! They shall soon see. I'll finish up the uh, damage on the punch. You'll notice that I haven't gone for regen quite yet, but that's basically because Skoldir packs his own regen as long as you're hitting the third punch consistently. Oh, that Raylan's in trouble. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Good. Got him with the uh, earthquake damage, I think. And then Durple got that monkey. So, uh, are you gonna come with me on the turret? We can do it right now. Yes, get out of here, Vinny. Yeah. Me and Durple, after the nuke, I was able to hit him with my third punch, uh, even while he was behind the turret. So, I guess we're gonna go into base a little bit. This probably doesn't seem like the best idea to me. I was kind of jumping around trying to message to Durple that maybe we shouldn't, but if he's in, I'm in. I can't just leave my buddy alone, and they did respond, so, um, hey, oh, fuck. I tried to jump in front of that, but, um, yeah, I should have just walked forward, maybe. Doesn't matter. We'll get this bottom turret while he responds. Boosh! Fucking Rocco. Boosh! Oh, yeah. Nicely. Nicely! And there's the killing spree! Yeah, that came around pretty quick. I thought we only had, we had gotten one kill before that, and we died twice. And now, now that my punch is fully upgraded, look at this! Fucking turning this monkey out! Oh, god damn it. Run from me! Can't let these guys get my fucking turret. Boop! Get out of here. Stand here and grind up some droids. I don't think Raylin's in trouble because she's not moving backwards. So I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna go home. Gonna buy some stuff. Um, let's go for damage on the throw. Pretty good. And we'll get that regen finally. Because it doesn't hurt. Uh, another good option probably would have been the distance on the throw and the stun duration. Because it'll really fuck somebody up. And I do get a boost, um, a movement speed boost every time I throw somebody successfully. So that is also why I like to upgrade the attack speed when when throwing successfully. Because you'll be able to just run up on somebody and boom, 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 boom. Like three hit combo them extremely quickly. I did let Durple take that arrow, but um, basically because I'm up here, I think it's going to be okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, go, go. Oh, fuck. Oh shit, oh no, uh oh! I thought I was out of there. <laughs> Alright, we are 4 and 3, they're over there still taunting, but I'm almost up to 2,000 solar, so... I think being top of the leaderboard shows that, uh, sometimes aggression, not stupid aggression, not trying to die aggression, come here you little bastard. But look, I'm at full health, I know he's gonna run, Yeah, there's the damage on the throw! Kills him, that was so awesome. Yeah, Skoldir's definitely a huge, huge threat, especially once he's uh, upgraded. You do have to kind of play him safe in the beginning. He does need to be carried around just a little bit. But once he gets there, oh my god, what a monster, dude. And he's got the coolest skins ever. And I'll steal this health. Throw! No turret for you! Ha ha ha! Boosh! Oh my god, so good. Oh, so good! Come on! Mm, he's got the healing bubble. I can do it! I can do it! I can do it! <laughs> yes! Oh, kill them all! Kill them all! I will go back for that Vinny. Put some DOT. Boop. And he's still floating down there, trying to uh, hold the bottom lane. He has the Rocco with him, but I don't care. I'm fucking scold here, son! Oh, where'd the Rocco go? Doesn't matter. <laughs> he dashed away. Boosh! And boosh! There! There! That is where the uh, base damage of the punch definitely made a difference instead of the range. Definitely taking some huge chunks out of that Vinny. Let's uh, back it up, back it up, back it up. Oh no, 
We're in here. We got droids and all this shit. Yeah, we're fine. So, friends, this has been Awesome Nuts. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Whee! <laughs> Riding the lift to victory. If you did enjoy this episode, I hope you'll like, comment, and or subscribe. And until the next time, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.